Okay, it is strawberry season right now at Lyman Orchards, but they're about to add even more to the pick your own options. Raspberries. Oh, all right, don't do a raspberry, Roger. We're talking about the fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Those fields are not the only spot to shop and stop that by this summer. Roger Suzanne is there live to show us all of the family friendly choices that they have going on. So, Roger, what are you doing now? Oh, he's got a Dairy basket full. Well, well, first of all, don't challenge me not to do a raspberry. I'm going to spin away so I don't get anybody. <laughs> There's a raspberry, but we're talking strawberries first. We've got the Stiver and Simonson family. Wave, guys. They are just like professionals. Look at all of those strawberries. And speaking of professionals, I'm joined by John Lyman. Yes, he's the owner, but I also call him just a professional picker because look at what he's picked for us. Well, you do some of that too, Roger, so good morning. <laughs> yeah, so basically John showed up and I was like, we need a few quarts and I need you to get to work. And you said, no problem, right? Picking so easy, it's no problem at all. So we're going to talk about raspberries in a second, but first of all, we got the strawberries in front of us. You said this is one of your best strawberry seasons you've had. It has been. Uh, I mean, season's a little early, so if you haven't picked, come on out this week because the season won't go as long this year. So uh, we've really got some really nice berries now, and uh, so um, it, it is a little earlier. And when I was telling you before that my wife and kids picked some strawberries for me for a delicious homemade strawberry shortcake, now strawberry season... Week to 10 days left, but we're also just kicking off a new season today, right? Yeah, our summer raspberries have started today, and they're coming along. They'll be in full peak in another week or so. And then blueberries will be starting in about a week to 10 days, and that crop looks really good as well. So, listen, all the berry seasons are awesome here, but you guys also have a really cool event coming up uh, that is the first time you've ever done it, right? Tell yeah. us about the hot balloon event. Yeah, the hot air balloon is going to be taken the first weekend in July. Um, it'll be uh, go on our website for all the times that we're going to be doing. It should be morning, early morning, and then later afternoon because it needs to be calm. You, know, you can't have a wind for the hot, hot air balloons. All right, now one other thing I want people to know, what is the key to getting the perfect berry? Give us the secrets, because I, I chatted with some of these kids. They know the secrets, but they wouldn't share them. Will you tell yeah. me, John, what are the secrets? Well, it's not, not too hard. You look for the color. You want to have 100% color, and it just easily just snap it back, and it, and that's all. And don't, don't squeeze too hard with your fingers, because otherwise you bruise them, because they're very tender. And one thing you did tell me, we're late in the strawberry season. That means the berries are even sweeter, like my singing voice. Check this out. Strawberry fields forever and oh you know what else we should probably be singing to you know any prince little raspberry beret R raspberry beret absolutely <laughs> will, you, will you show i'm not going to sing it no believe me you don't want to hear me sing raspberry beret here at lime in orchards we'll work on wow. that we'll work on that we're having a lot of fun here in middlefield and john you're a great sport and same with uh, our, our great family you know we're live in middlefield with some great strawberries I'm we Channel 3 Eyewitness News. I thought I was going to get you, John. We I really asked did. and he delivered. <laughs> he did. He did a great job. Maybe he's bidding on that <laughs> Prince, what was it, the, the oh, original? Yes, one of the original tapes that Prince yeah. of his first recordings. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, that was great. 